Hi, Brent Tech here. Where tech is made simple. Apparently, there are reports regarding issues with the desktop window manager DWM for short on Windows 10 and 11 devices using the Intel integrated graphics on those Intel based systems. Now, this uh, uh, latest issue apparently is causing higher memory usage than normal in the desktop window manager in both Windows 10 and 11. And just in case you didn't know what the desktop window manager is, it's basically built into the Windows um, operating system and is responsible for your taskbar thumbnails and your um, application windows in the Windows operating system itself. Now, the easiest way to check if this um, issue is affecting your system um, in Windows 10 is to right click on your taskbar and in the fly out pop out menu just go to task manager um, and in Windows 11 the easiest is just to go right click on your um, start menu um, icon and then task manager in it. and in task manager we need to look for the desktop windows manager process which is found near the bottom under windows processes and here you can see desktop window manager and if it's not called desktop window manager it will be called dwm.exe and as a general rule of thumb you shouldn't be using more than 100 megabytes for the desktop window manager regarding your memory usage as you can see i'm using 92.3 obviously this will depend and more the more application windows and and so on that you have open this will increase uh, in usage but generally um, you shouldn't have more than 100 megabytes in use and it, if you are noticing that that is over 100 megabytes of memory usage then you could have this bug um, regarding the desktop window manager on your intel based system and intel has recently um, rolled out a new driver for those uh, integrated graphics those intel integrated graphics on um, for both windows 10 and 11 which is a uh, version uh, intel dch 30.0.101.1191 now if you are running a newer system this latest driver update from intel will roll out um, through the windows update process on both windows 10 and 11 and then to check for this on both windows 10 and 11 you can just right click again on your start menu icon and this time we head to device manager and in device manager you just go to display adapters and just click on your integrated graphics then driver and this is the latest version 30.0101.1191 and mine rolled out on the 3rd of december this year through windows update as i am running and this, this Windows 11 device of mine is a newer device. And obviously, this will also depend on your system manufacturer as well. Now, if you don't see the, uh, if you don't have the latest driver version, and obviously, maybe you are experiencing this problem, you can always head over to Intel's website and download the um, Intel driver and support assistant tool. And I will leave a link to this web page down below for easy reference where you can just uh, download that driver and support assistant tool, download it, run the tool, and then that will um, automatically scan your system for the necessary Intel drivers that are needed. And if you'd like to download the offline installer, I will also leave this web page down below. You can just head over to um, the Intel Download Center for that Intel Graphics Windows DCH driver the latest version 30.0101.1191 and you can download the exe or the zip file and that's for both windows 10 and 11 and you can just run that manually and upgrade into um, this latest driver if you are experiencing the problem mentioned in this video where the desktop window manager is using higher memory usage than normal which will cause stability issues then According to Intel, this latest driver will address and fix that problem. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.